Do we want to just? Do we want to just do the? You want to do power just... rankings? Compare. Get it over with. I have no idea. Oh, I gotta add it. Hold on. I just. Ba, 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 just... Ba, ba. I don't. I don't think I even want to know, honestly. All right, you ready? <sighs> Three, two, one. Blast off, Phoebe boy. You put the Texans at fourteen. What? I'm sorry. And now I'm just seeing that. So the Lions are. T I felt bad for putting them at six, and you put them in a. T the Vikings are four. Yeah, bro. I'm sorry. The what? Texans almost beat the Chiefs. They almost beat the Cowboys. They won one game, Brandon. And they, they get won credit. one game. Yeah, one. But we're talking what Uno. just happened. We are in December football. And right you know now, I am never going to question my own power. One of the most again. competitive teams in the NFL. Never going and to question even have their best player out there. Oh. He's hurt. Oh, Damian Pierce is hurt. It took the Chiefs into overtime. The Chiefs. The Colts beat the Chiefs. Where don't are the Colts care. on the list? Hopefully the Chiefs don't play any bottom tier teams in the playoffs because they will be bounced. They will be bounced. Yeah, I put the Raiders back in because, boy, did they bring me some joy when they <laughs> embarrassed the Patriots. Okay, I need to. I need to. Okay, we got the Eagles. Got that. Got Eagles okay. number one. Even with Gardner Brandon? Minshew this week, no, 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 no. I could make him a, even a zero because that's how much I believe in him with Gardner Minshew. I would have done it. You know, <laughs> a zero. I need you to stand up and tell me, God, and everyone in this chat and everyone in this Chili's tonight, how in God's name you have the 49ers at six. At six, Brandon. Oh, that's easy. They played on Thursday. That was a long time ago. <laughs> They're they're so far out of my memory. It's like, are they even a team anymore? Uh, let's let's just get high on life, guys. High. You tried the drug life. <laughs> It'll make you crazy. You have them at six because they yeah. played a long time ago. Look, I'm no. gonna say it. I don't know how long I can trust Brock Purdy. What about the defense? That's like number one in like oh, every meaningful great. category. Great defense, great. Right. They destroyed the Seahawks. Great defense, great defense. Let me see one Brandon, more. I need one more outing from Brock. You need one. They've won seven straight games. Yeah, but they've only won two in a row with Brock as a starter. I guess two and a half. And I like Brock Purdy. Uh, last week I made a video saying he's he's good. He's good enough. But sorry if I don't trust him. Right now. I trust the Eagles and Hurts. I trust Josh Allen and the Bills. I trust Joey Burrow and the Bengals. You trust Kirk, Kirk Cousins, Cousins has led two of the biggest comebacks in the last, I don't know, 10 years, eight years. I forget. I it's trust the Jared ever. Goff. The only quarterback I trust less than Brock Purdy is clearly Patrick Mahomes because the Chiefs ain't as good as the 49ers. Well, you know what? We also we do have another one. So because my honorable mention, because, you know, I stick within the top 10 parameters. My honorable mention this week was the Jaguars and you had them at 11. Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, so we, we got that. The Dolphins, they beat the Cowboys, you know, they beat, the, they beat the Cowboys. So the Cowboys fell to nine for me. All right. So that's about there. Nine and 10 for the Dolphins, because that's the best they've looked in a month because like they've lost mm -hmm. three straight. But I feel like they played really well against the Bills. The Lions. Fine, I get it. Six to five. The the Vikings, I just don't believe. The Lions beat the Vikings literally two weeks ago. Yeah, but if I'm being completely honest, yep. as a football team, yep. you wipe away a 33-point deficit, I think there's just that, that momentum that follows that. I think like that builds a, a level of confidence – in your football team where you're not going to get shook no matter what happens. And I think the Vi the, the Lions are in the same position where they're one and six and they've ripped seven off seven. Uh, six or seven. So that's why I put the Vikings up that high. And you could, you can call out some bullshit on my list. That's fine. Probably true. But the Vikings at four right now, this week, I stand by. There is that. no way on God's green earth that the 49ers are below the Vikings. There's just not. There's just. I don't know. What are the 49ers going to get a, a, 
a, a 14 point lead against them. Ooh. Ooh. We erased a 33 point deficit. The Colts. We will persevere. The Colts. Minnesota. Scored 33 on the Vikings defense. And yes, the second half was very impressive. But the first half was also garbage. Like, it's, it's the gonna, Colts. It's, yeah, no, I don't think it's going to happen again, though. The Vikings could be 10 next week. We'll see. We'll see. Brandon. 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 I'm going to become a likable Nick Wright. Who do the 49ers play this week? The Commanders. Oh. See, the Commanders are like the 49ers, but without an offense. <laughs> their their defense is nothing like the 49ers. Their defense has been decent. It's decent. The 49ers are the best in the league on in defense. Easy. Easy. I I don't if Brock Purdy and the 49ers offense torch the commanders, I will take notice. I will take notice. I will take heed. Weren't they high in your power rankings last week? Yeah, they're number two. So you believed in Brock Purdy after one and a half starts. Then yeah. he wins again in a definitive win, and they've dropped. To yeah, six. but he didn't look as good in that game to me. We're not ranking Brock Purdy. We're ranking the team. Yeah, but he's the quarterback. It's less about the 49ers and more about my belief in the Detroit Lions and me being wowed by the Vikings this week. Okay. <laughs> okay. Man, okay. I should start selling drugs. 